All right, happy Independence Day. So take a look at this. This bald eagle fledgling is flapping his wings, yeah. Giving us a little surprise this Independence Day. The majestic bald eagle. Yes, he's going to be quite a handsome adult when he fledges. So yeah, it looks like he's got the flying thing nailed down because he is um, on other tree branches outside of the nest. So that's a good start. Very, very cool. Look at that. So I'm, I don't have this zoomed in all the way because you're not really going to see this bald eagle very much anyways. And I figured this would probably be a good chance to see some flight action here. Oh yeah, look at that. Yeah. Wow. Check that out. So yes, I'm giving you a little late Independence Day video here. It is currently 6.49 right now. Oh, wait a minute. Gotta zoom that thing out. Yes, yeah, so the bald eagle landed right there. And let me just... Do this way quick. I'm gonna tilt this up just a little bit. Oh yeah, look at that. And then he comes back down again. Yeah, it doesn't get any better than that. So we can zoom in all the way here on this bald eagle right here. Oh, there we go. Crap, I gotta... Yeah, I mean, to see the bald eagle, I have to, like, tilt this whole camera out. Which is always, like, the hardest thing. So I think I'll just keep it where it's at right now. Yeah, I apologize for the lighting. The lighting isn't very great because it's cloudy out right now. And that's what happens on a cloudy day. You don't really get the, the detail of the bald eagle that you want to get. See, look. See, still no detail on the eagle. Just looks like a dark shadow. All right, so let me zoom out a little bit here. Got to zoom out all the way out because, um, yeah, I, 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 I had to actually put my hand on the camera to tilt it. I'm not, I wasn't actually tilting the tripod, I was tilting the camera, only because this is a very sensitive tripod. So if I try to mess with it, um, it's gonna mess everything up and I'd rather just try to get the footage for as long as I possibly can. My style of filming is a little bit different from others. I like to try to keep my camera on the subject. Anything that seems unnecessary, I, I just try to film it all. Like, here comes the train. Yeah, so um, this is what I want to try to do. I'm going to try to tilt this just a little bit and tilt this up anyways so that I can get a better view here. Oh, see that? So this gives you an idea of 
how close I am to this bald eagle. As you can see, just a slight, slight, slight amount of tilt will cause me to lose the subject. Yes, even just a very, very slight amount of tilt. So if I zoom this in, now you can really see them. And if I zoom, if I put this down a little bit, you can see, oh, you can't really see his talons because the tree stump's blocking the way. But yeah, sometimes I get lucky, even though, um, you know, as far as the lighting goes. I mean, I zoom in and it still looks very dark. So he might fly onto the other branch at some point. So I'll just stay here and try to catch that action. So happy um, Independence Day to everybody. I think filming a bald eagle is just perfectly film or perfectly fitting for a day like this. You really can't go wrong filming a bald eagle on Independence Day, our nation's birthday right here. This, this is like what I would call just, uh, you know, just perfect. I mean, I don't really know what else to say. I'm speechless. <laughs> Oh, what do we got here? There's another bird right next to this bald eagle. Did you see that? Wow, I've never seen another bird get that close to a raptor before. Like that bird was really, really close. Hard to believe the parents aren't, like, <laughs> you know, protecting the nest or anything like that. That bird just came and went. I don't know what bird that was. Could have been a chipping sparrow, maybe. Yeah, I do apologize that the lighting isn't quite as good as it usually is. It is overcast. It's a little bit better when I zoom in. But I have to tilt this camera up, otherwise it does that. Yeah, so there we go. So I am almost... Yeah, so that's all the way at uh, right when I start digital zoom. So yeah, the optical zoom goes all the way to there. So you want to know the distance that I am from this nest? Well, I can show you right now. Take a look at this. There you go. That's how far away I am from the nest. All right, coming back in now. There we go. Yep, pretty amazing camera, huh? Yeah, my Nikon P900 sure does its wonders. Yeah, I think I'll cut it short today. Because this bald eagle is not really doing very much. Oh, and by the way, um, I checked the bare branch and the, neither of the parents were there. I mean, they might come back later, but I'm not going to be here to find out because I have to go to bed early because I got to wake up early to go to work the next day because I have to work at 7 a.m. 
tomorrow. So it is now 6.57 right now. And I'm gonna stay here for another five minutes. Then I'm going home. Sorry about that. So I've actually, let's see, I'm just, I actually have this second camera that I'm testing out, bear, or, um, don't mind me. <laughs> don't mind what I'm doing right now. So this, uh, Just zoom that out a little bit more. Yeah, so let's uh, zoom in even more here. I always find it interesting that this bald eagle never looks directly at me, unlike the parents. Like, he doesn't even realize I'm here, filming him. How rude is that? I think a bald eagle should know that I'm filming him because, well, I mean, wouldn't you feel bad if you were a celebrity or something and nobody ever filmed you? <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Just kidding about that. <laughs> uh, All right. Yep, so just uh, two minutes left. Two minutes and 11 seconds, and then I'll, s you know, that's pretty much all I have for the recording. It automatically stops after 15 minutes. So that means I never actually have to press the stop button. It can just keep on rolling. Yeah. All right, so, yeah, before I go, I always make my mark. I just want to just say I'm glad to live in this wonderful nation that we call home here in the United States of America. Happy Independence Day, everybody. And
and I'll see you next time. Oh my gosh, guess what? One of the bald eagle parents is actually on the bare branch. Yes. So let's go and take a good look at him here. And it is actually the mother. Because it's the banded one. Yes. 100% it is the mother. Hang on a second. I just got to adjust this a little bit more here. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, I can't believe it. Um, so this bald eagle must have flew there um, while I was watching the nest, which is what happened last time, too. I'm starting to wonder if, if she just, I don't know, like, she just knows I'm here. Well, she's not staring at me, so that's a good thing. And you can see that she's preening right now. Very nice. So this is the way to celebrate Independence Day the right way. Yes, filming this adult bald eagle. Watching the, the views from all the way up on that bare branch. She just looks so powerful all the way up there. Looking at the surrounding lakes, rivers, forests, fields. Yes, and that's how far away I am from this bald eagle. Just that everybody knows, okay? That's zoomed out all the way. And now I'm going to zoom back in again, okay? There we go, all right. If I tilt this down a little bit, I can get a better view. Oh yeah, there we go. So the view's a lot better from right there since there's no tree branches or anything blocking it. So the lighting is, well, almost perfect. So the thing that I like about this bald eagle right now is that she's preening and she's got no distractions, okay? The red-winged blackbirds aren't attacking her again, so everything's all good. So this is the way and my Independence Day turned out for the better. So I'm going to stay here for, well, another 10 minutes. Unless I notice that something else is going on in the nest after that, then there is a slight possibility I could stay longer.
I can hear another bald eagle calling, which is most likely the father. So it's possible that he found something to feed the nestling. And she's looking at me. She is looking at me. And she does it again. And she does it again. Here comes a train. So it seems like she looks one way and then looks in my way. She did that at least three times. She's looking at me, giving me that stare, that eye-glancing look. Oh. Well, happy Independence Day to you, bald eagle. Well, somebody's doing some fireworks already. Wow, this early? The bald eagle is wary. Hmm. Well, I saw a bird just fly past the bald eagle. What do you think it is? Maybe this bald eagle won't pay any attention to it.
I need to tilt the tripod up just a little bit. Ooh, I don't think I can. There we go. Oh, she's looking at me. Yep, so in about 30 seconds I'm going to stop with the footage. And I'm just going to call it a night until tomorrow. Alright, that's all the footage for today. Take care, see ya.